Hey guys, welcome back to the channel of Jimmy's Promo. Today is August 25th and very soon we'll be able to see a brand new feature that I've been waiting for for Samsung Win UI 5.0 with Android 13. Now this is a brand new mode that you're able to put your cell phone into that if you take it into a repair shop, they're not able to see your sensitive or important information. They can't go through messages, photos, or anything like that. So this one is coming very soon. I was hoping to have it right now for this video because if you go inside of the Samsung Samsung members application. If you're a part of the Samsung beta program, which I'm a part of the beta program, this is now going to be update number two. I'm hoping the full launch will come out to all of the Samsung phones, or at least the Galaxy S22 series, maybe sometime in September. The latest will be October. I'm only going to say September because Google has already pushed off their Android 13 to their Pixel devices already, which is pretty early. So this is the update that I'm waiting for. It says it's being pushed out on August 25th, which is right now. It stated it this morning at 9.36 a.m., so maybe I'll see it later today, maybe tomorrow, and I will shoot another video so we can take a look at this firsthand. The software version here is ZVHK, and what it's coming with is these new features. Now, this one in the middle is the one that we're talking about really as the main point of today's video, but we're also gonna get a brand new widget. This is a smart suggestions widget. This is one that will suggest useful apps or features. Here Here's maintenance mode. So again, you put it inside of maintenance mode, which protects your personal information while others use the smartphone, such as mobile repair shops. So if you have a cracked screen, you don't want them to go through your personal information. You just want them to fix the screen. You can put it inside of this mode. And so basically they're not able to access personal data in photos, messages, accounts, and they're only able to see apps that are installed by default. This is super smart and important. I don't know why this mode wasn't there from before. And then it also comes with a privacy detection. This privacy detection is when you're using that share panel, uh, you, it will let you know when you attempt to share photos that contain sensitive information, such as credit cards, ID cards, passports. So this way you can reconsider whether you want to share it or not. And then there's just a handful of bugs that will be fixed. I haven't ran into any of these issues, so there's really nothing for me to really talk about with the issues that they're talking about here. And I really can't show it in the video, especially if this is something being fixed with this update here. Uh, but again, I will be shooting another video talking about this one the moment it does come out. So if you guys are interested, make sure you guys hit that subscribe button, hit on the like, write a comment below, do whatever you want to get this video out to more people. Uh, it'll help the algorithm definitely. And then you'll be able to come back. We'll take a look at this feature right here, maintenance mode. It's one of those that's very important. So after I noticed that I had this update sitting there, I wanted to go through my settings just to see if the update was sitting there and it's not. This is one of those that should be being pushed out. A lot of times you do have to search for it for yourself. I've already restarted the phone. It shows that I'm using the current version, which is the beta version one ZVH4. So again, waiting for this update to come through. I'm excited to share it with you guys because I want to play with that maintenance mode because if I take this phone in to get it repaired, you know, fix a cracked screen, fix whatever issue I may have internally on the phone, don't want them to go through my stuff. Now, if you are interested and curious on everything that Samsung has added in so far with this update that we have currently with Samsung Win UI 5 with Android 13. I do have two video links below the video inside the description. One of them is showing you every single thing that's brand new with this update. And the other one's just gonna show you the top features of this update here. You can watch any of those ones. I can also place them right up over here. Those two videos, you can click on those. And also, if you appreciated this video, hit on that subscribe button right over here in the very bottom left-hand side. And I'll see you guys on the next one.